experiment from the home location, use the stylus to move the red dot, which will appear under the nib, across the pad to the yellow target, which will burst when you hit it. Your task is to do this as quickly as possible. During the full experiment, you will not be able to view your hand movements through the mirror panel. And then in the real one, um, what we do is we cover this part so you can't see your hand movements anymore. So it's harder to be quite as precise as you were. Yeah, so if you just keep doing one. that as quickly as you can, um, you'll notice that at some point it's going to get more difficult. Um, but just just try to correct your movement as you go along and try to keep hitting that um, yellow target. No, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so now Good. it's going off in a curve. Mm -hmm. So you'll notice you're trying to, you're starting to adjust your movement yeah. so that you hit that target better to compensate for that. I'm not doing very well at it. <laughs> so the idea is I have okay. to push the red dot to hit the yellow dot and whilst I'm trying to move the pen straight the actual dot moves off into a curve so I've got to correct where I've gone to get to the yellow dot and then it changes which side of the target it's curving away from. <coughs> so that one is now going quite straight. So that's quite easy to do. But when it was curving, I'm having to correct. Um, I'm trying to predict which way it's going to go around the dot that way or that way. So, um, yes. Yeah. So what's that measuring? Um, so again, motor tasks, so motor flexibility, so how quickly um, do older people take longer to correct that movement? Um, and, and then younger people, are younger people better at realizing quickly what's happened and correcting for that? Right. Um, that's what that's looking at. So yeah, the target moves um, a few degrees to the right and then a few degrees to the left. And you notice that maybe in the first, in the first, the first part it moved, um, you were quite slow at correcting. Yes. But the second part it happened, towards the end of the task, you were a bit quicker at doing yeah. that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So both of the tasks are looking at, um, at um, motor, motor reflexes, motor movement, um, um, but in different ways. This is motor learning, and this is kind of a force matching task. Right. Very interesting. Okay. Yes. Okay, so that's come through.